Mm. These are, are domesticated pigs um, for Stanley, so that he can raise them for, for meat and such. Look at those. I thought you had shaved them. I was really worried. Look at no, them. Different, different breed, you know. These yeah. are much cuter. Yeah, notice now they don't have the long tusks either. Nope, nope, they're much safer to handle. Uh, you know, they've been bred for, for meat purposes, so they, you know, they grow a lot of meat and fat on them, but uh, they're very cute, too. You should sit here, watch, watch as they waddle around. They're very adorable, although uh, I'm sure they're very delicious, too. Yeah, especially if you add a little salt and and you cure it a little bit and mm, bacon, crispy. I think to see if they have human teeth in their mouth. I don't think they huh? do. They're very happy. I don't think they do. They, they I hope look, they don't. Yeah, I don't think so. I think we're all right. What do you think, Pocket? Is it human teeth or, or is it big teeth? Well, can eat. Uh, should I bring them to the barn uh, where the cattle are, do you think? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I think so. You haven't seen Stanley about, have you? No, not recently. Uh, he stayed behind when we went out uh, sailing and we hadn't seen him since. No, we haven't seen him. We just came in on a fast wind of a tornado. Uh, yes, I, I saw that. Uh, I, I, I saw how deadly it was getting, so I went further out to see, um, to, to calm it a bit, you know. Uh, I didn't realize I was being followed in, you know. Uh, but um, I'm glad everyone's all right. Yeah, uh, Elias got a bump on the head, and, and uh, uh, the cells were still full fully opened and just luckily I grabbed the wheel and, and told the crew to slow down oh dear yes, it was quite a bad storm you rough. know I heard that in my studio when I was painting and I was like man that's a awful storm out there that was really bad well I'm going to run these over to the barn real quick um and uh, make sure they have food. Um, Are you hiding that fur hat? That was surprising. Uh, I'm actually really cold right now. I, I don't know about... All right. You're not getting a fever, are you? But I hope. You feel all right? I'm, I'm, I'm feeling just fine. All right. <laughs> I purchased him from. Uh, he's going to uh, start selling floppy eared bunnies and also large bunnies. I, I, I haven't seen the large bunnies before. Well, yeah, we have to take a look at that. Yeah, yeah. we do. Oh, there we go. How large? Tall as the house, maybe? Uh, but I don't know. Uh, I I inquired, but he hadn't uh, gotten them yet. He he was using the coin that he had gotten off me for the pigs, uh, to go purchase the, the proper literature for care, and uh, was planning to to start reading them either later tonight or tomorrow. Actually. Aha! Uh -huh. I want to see one of these pigs when it's little. I want to see a tiny pig without the hair on it. I, I yeah. have been informed that they're quite adorable. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Uh, but you know, uh, they serve the purpose. Uh, there's a lady over in um, uh, what was it, C four, uh, that's selling domesticated chickens. If you wanted to get a breeding set, uh, she would sell you one or a pair for three gold. Oh, that's not bad. Said it was half the price of the free pot. Mm-hmm. 
it's not bad at all really um these two uh would normally be five gold but because i do business and provide the uh the salty part with um prawns and crustaceans and all that uh, they, they gave me a deal of uh four gold for the, the, the yeah that's not bad anyway i don't think so uh, and uh, they breed much quicker as well than the cattle so we'll have a lot of pork to eat I brought home quite a bit of coin today there were a lot of boxes of garbage out there but they had some coins in them no but that's good yeah we made enough to make payroll this week but that if you have any extra you know just let me know hello Elias. hello uh, meet our, our new uh uh town members Ink and oink. Oh, oh they, uh, yes, they, they have some name tags, but I, I assume that Stanley will probably be fine renaming them. But I, I wasn't too fond of the names given. It was a uh, poop and I pip. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Not very suitable names, really. I suppose. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but uh, we can rename them, of course. I'll, I'll leave that up to Stanley. But yeah. That's good. We need more pigs here. <laughs> yes. uh, but these ones, uh, they, they apparently uh, breed very quickly, and you get, uh, you know, uh, between uh, two to, to six uh, uh, little piggets from each one. That's so, the world. Yeah, so... Up to, yes. Uh, so we should have a lot of pork to eat soon. Oh. Yes, it's, 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 it's already laid a pork uh, egg right out, out beside of it, yes. I just put an egg out. Oh, no. Uh, no, no, I, I think that, I, I, I'm pretty sure that's feces. Oh, that was... Yeah. We need that for the crops <laughs> as well. Yeah, well, there you go. You, got, uh, mm -hmm. you can go ahead and collect that then if you'd like. Uh, but yes, uh, let me know, uh, what did you say the lady was uh, with the chickens? Um, let me check my map. I think they called the place Paradise. No. Well, I don't Paradise. think that was the official, official name or anything. That's Paradise? Or... Paradise. Paradise. Oh. Uh, it's uh, the northwestern island in C3. Uh, something fields. Mm -hmm. Had some sort of goat that was a doctor there. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it was unusual. It lives on top of a house. If you can get up there, you can be doctored, I guess. Mm -hmm. And it has real pretty eyes. Yeah, the eyes are nice. Yeah, I was kind of thinking about studying a little bit uh, on the domesticated chickens uh, since I'm getting so many eggs. It uh, um, feels like uh, I should be able to chop up a few and have some fried chicken sometime. Mm -hmm. That could be good. Well, I definitely have some recipes uh, for it, so. Uh, well... Uh, I think that uh, my plans for tomorrow were to head north to the Proudshire, and that's not very far, taking a look at the map from Proudshire, uh, so I could put it on my uh, my list of places to visit. Right. Are you going to take a look at that uh, for the art event sign, too? Uh, yes, yes, I'll take a look to see if I can find that while I'm there as well. Okay, I'd be curious to know uh, about that. Fair, fair. Um, yes, I'll definitely take a look. Oh, and there was a letter in the mailbox. Uh, uh, I think the Royal Society said there's a grand opening of the zoo. Oh, yes, I, I actually put that letter there. Uh, it was the easiest way to let you all know uh, since I got home so late the other night. Okay. I think it was May 4th. 
Uh, who is that? May 4th. May the 4th. May the 4th be with you. Um, I, I could be mistaken. I, I, it's, it's I thought it was the first. Yes, it's May 1st. Uh, Sunday. Uh, May Sunday. the 1st. Right, right. Um, but uh, the, the opening, uh, grand opening is uh, 4 p.m. Uh, Pacific stars. Um, uh, for me, that I believe is 7 p.m. Eastern stars. Uh, but they're planning on running for about four hours uh, from seven uh, for the grand opening. Uh, so it'll be late into the evening. And um, But uh, after that, it'll be open 24-7. So if you can't make it to the grand opening, you can go there any time and the doors will be open for you. And the tigers will be on Rome waiting to attack. Uh, no, I, I've actually um, seen the, 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 in, in the, the, the design uh, that uh, uh, Governor um, Higgins came up with is so much better than uh, previous, and I, I think the safety issues have have all certainly been, um, you know, alleviated. Well, that would be good. Mm-hmm. Not and kidding. you got uh, all the dead body away. Oh gosh. But if, the, if but if they have vultures, the uh, vultures will take care of the dead body. Unfortunately, we don't have a vulture to handle the smelly fish at the end of the town. Oh, um, right. Um, <laughs> what, let me let me get these um, to the barn, and then and I'll be back. Or it shouldn't take long. Come on, pigs. Come on. Goodbye, oink. Oink and oink. They run so cute. They do. I don't want to eat them now. Yeah, I might not go and visit so them. So delicious at and so cute. If they run loose, they may get whacked. I'm just saying, all pigs will look alike. Uh, how can that look alike? It, it doesn't even have hair on it. Pig's a pig. <clears throat> it's a pig pocket. You hear that? No. So if it goes oink, it's a pig. There's so many here already. It's it's up to Elias to keep the island from being overrun. Do you have your spray gun? Yes. Yeah, uh, the one that does the uh, the flooring. I have one filled with mud. Yes, I put mud in the sprayer. Okay. Uh, can I see it?
hurt us, didn't they? My goodness. Hmm? Oh, they were painted, I didn't realize. Yeah, there's uh, three in that other stall. And uh, all this didn't get painted. Here's your painter back. You know where the barley seeds went from earlier today? Mm, it's in the little storage box next to the alchemy station. All right. All right. You still want me to tell him? Coming in with the raid, it's have a heart. Right, uh, well, how are uh, you? Let's see how it goes. Here, this is all new. Oh yeah, we're leveling the town out. This is quite nice, actually. Uh, uh, Elias, uh, do you do you have a moment, sir? Let's see how this works. Okay. Uh, Watch this chat. Could, uh, if maybe we could talk in the barn for a moment. Barn. Why is he going that way for? This is not the barn. This is a workshop. Oh, I, I, I think he went to the the, the barn and not the workshop. I, that was my. The other day, the uh, other night, um, a gentleman came to our port, and uh, Stanley and I talked to him extensively, and we purchased some, you know, clothes, and like this hat here that I'm wearing, I got from him. Uh, a very what nice gentleman. What was that? The one we're afraid is dead. Yes. Um, <laughs> uh, so, uh, that gentleman is still here. His ship is down at the end of the docks, and... Uh, so, uh, we, I, how do I put this? Uh, first off, this has nothing to do with the notices that you've been receiving as far as the um, warranty issue. Uh, we still need to go to the court and get that resolved. And if there's a particular day that you would like to do so, I'd be more than happy to do so. Okay. <laughs> so, but uh, in the... The, the items or the, the things that uh, the cylinder has with uh, are, are not um, aggressive and, and uh, in no way uh, are they, uh, you know, here to, to um, enforce said uh, warranting that they're not related. All right? Definitely not an army here. 
no, mm -mm. no, no. Let's 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 avoid the, those words, uh, Mr. Boggart. Um, so Elias, um, the ship at the end behind the signs uh, does have some uh, clockworks on it. No. <laughs> Uh, no, 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 it's fine. Uh, they are not, no, no, Elias, they're not aggressive. Um, they're just being used by the gentleman so that he can display his clothing. Uh, they, they, are, they are passive and, and safe. Uh, but the reason, you know, we, we, we just we didn't want you to be put in a position to be surprised by it, is all. Elias, are you all right, sir? Elias? Yes? Um, is everything all right so far? Not sure. Uh, fair, fair. So... I think you've done it. Look, so, so we just want to... The, the, the clockworks are, are passive, and, and they are not uh, anything to be feared. Uh, the gentleman has them well under control. And like I said, he's just using them to display his products. And, you know, it's, it's a very efficient way to do so. Uh, it, 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 you know, we, we didn't realize that, that the concern when we let him stay here, uh, me and Stanley, the other night. And uh, I am sure that uh, he will soon be on his way, as he's a traveling merchant. Uh, so there's really nothing to worry about, uh, but uh, I just wanted to, you know, to be open and honest with you about the situation. You know, the... Uh, so, you do you want to face your fears and take a closer look? Stay think, yeah. out of the south side. Yeah, the south side. Stay over here, Elias. It's fine. It's just temporary, though. Um, I, I understand the concern with them. Uh, they, they are very weird things. And, uh, you know, we, we just, you know, we didn't want you to, to stumble over that and, and find, you know, something that you weren't expecting, you know? When's he leaving? Well, I, I don't know. Uh, he hasn't uh, awakened uh, but I know that he, he has awakened at least another a night or so ago because his, uh, his ship, that there was a, you know, he had a bit of a fire going to, to cook something. Uh, but, uh, but I haven't seen him since. And there was uh, someone which... sweeping the deck and they're no longer there. So I think the stench mm -hmm. of the body is starting to uh, fumigate. Right. Well, let's, <laughs> let's, they let's killed it. it. Uh, no, 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 let's, 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 no, no, let's not get ahead of ourselves here. The, the gentleman is likely just sleeping, and he probably just forgot to pay the crew. And, and you know, it happens. Uh, you know, you don't pay a crew, they get upset and they leave. Uh, it's, but it's, the it's, clocks work instantly, you know, uh, so the, the, they're, they're there. Mm -mm. They're, right, they're but, but always the, around. But but they haven't moved, right? Uh, they're deactivated. They 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 are, they are. Oh, one of them has clothing on, and it didn't have clothing on just yesterday. Uh huh. That's yes. a good sign that the gentleman's awake. You know, he's it's wearing the crew's clothing. It probably is. Oh, I don't think of that. Um, I, yes, I, I still let off of him. If we thought all this through. Bogart, Bogart, Tansy, you're not helping here. Fire on board the ship. Now there's a missing crew member. Elias. Elias. <laughs> I think it went over well. I don't think it could have gone any better. You wanted to be truthful, though, about the whole thing. You wanted to bring out the truth of it all, and we didn't want to hold back. While we're, while we're giving out the truth, we might as well mention the murder and the fires and the army. 
that that's speculation. That's not you know exactly truth. It, it's it, we don't know these things. We, we're just oh, that, that's speculation. There was a fire on board the ship. You you said that. I'm not making that up. It's not conjecture. But not not a, like an uncontrolled fire though. A fire to cook things. You know, like a true uh, sign of activity. I thought they were burning the bodies out there. The clockworks were burning the bodies. No, 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 no. See, that's that's what what this whole went wrong. The wrong impression, I think, was given. All right. Well, but how do you know for sure? Have you well, checked the bow? Well, I I don't. I think you're right. I don't know for sure. But how do you know for sure that the clockworks have done anything nefarious? The one that had no clothing on is wearing clothing mm -hmm. now. Clearly they're able to move around on their own and dress themselves. I think it probably is wearing the clothing of the poor and mute. Well, the, the gentleman is a tailor, though. He, he does dress them with his works. He, he's probably just mm -hmm. been working down below deck on, on clothing all this time. Could be. That's an option. And uh, they wouldn't leave a... A note or something to say in hi, uh, just still over here. Would you be interested in buying some of my clothing? I could have written a note that said, don't mind the army. We're just here to sell clothing. And then we could have shown it to Elias and said, look, Elias, this came from the actual person on board the ship. Now it's too late for all that. But that that's a fair assessment, but but I mean, do take in mind that the, the gentleman was given permission to stay here, so he he's he doesn't realize that the the commotion that he's probably causing. You know, it, it was Stanley and I's misjudgment there, and I certainly mm -hmm. apologize. I didn't think it through. <laughs> um, uh, well, I think it went well with Elias. He seems to he seems to know everything now. Yeah, may, may, maybe. Not sure still buddy. haven't heard any gunshots either. Right. That's a good sign. Then again, where did he go? Yeah, that's a good question. Hello. Uh, uh he went to his boat? Uh, oh, there he is. Uh, uh, don't, don't, no, no sudden moves. Um, yeah, just nice and slow. Nice and slow, Owen, please. Nice and slow. <laughs> is, he, is he holding a gun in there? Yes, I think it's pointed toward us. <laughs> oh, um, hmm. just maybe, um, Lies. I'm not worried. I'm just watching. It's probably a good idea to watch, since we don't know for sure. Uh-huh. But watching is, is all right. Yes, I suppose. Uh, but uh, perhaps... um. Perhaps not aiming the, the weapon uh, down the, the public docks, you, you know? Maybe just, uh, yes, relaxing. Just uh, uh, There we go. I suppose that's something better. Staring ominously out the window. Mm. Intimidation is the first stage. When you're being approached by an army, you want to intimidate them first. It the, uh, Intimidate an army? Uh, wording, wording, phrasing, folks. You, you, uh, it's, it's just a, a collection of inanimate objects being used to display clothing. When you're not worried about the army, there's no reason to be ready and try to intimidate them. Is that better? <laughs> Sure, to be honest. Um, would you like me to leave a note on his ship for him? No, it's fine. Right. Uh, well, uh, Elias, I, I, 
Perhaps uh, I was misguided, but I thought it was uh, best to, to let you know the situation so that you, you know uh, that there's nothing to worry about and, and that uh, it is being settled over time. And uh, the gentleman may actually have some really nice clothing that you may enjoy. I think we need more lights in town. We do, don't we? Oh, quite a few. A lot more lighting in that direction. So oh. you can see. Oh, I got a perfect light. Those new little spotlights. Those those would be perfect. Oh, yeah. We could yeah. put one right here on Elias's rail so he has a spotlight. Mm-hmm. Straight. That's, that's straight. idea. Straight down the dock, yes. All right. You get the spotlight. I'll get the mounting area. You could run a little faster. There's two of them. You might want to put it right next to the ship. All right, Elias, it's out here. Is it on? No, not yet. You want to turn it on, Elias? <laughs> I can put it on for you. I think that's Mr. That's Mr. Owen. Hey. Yes, it's just me. Um, look, so I, I did go over to the ship in the, the, the clothing that has been placed on uh, the, the clockwork is not the clothing that the, the crew was wearing and i can still hear uh, the snoring down below so I'm, I'm fairly certain the gentleman is just sleeping ah okay yeah. all right if you don't think it's animals in there eating the body uh, no no that that would make a distinctive noise you know and, and plus how how could animals get in it's it's tightly sealed i checked probably a pig probably there's a lot of them here they're very hungry. I see them trying to get in the garden all the time. Mm-hmm. And they can squeeze into lock anywhere. Uh, but like, yeah, they really can. Pansy, look at that. You're not helping here. But we're trying to calm the fears, remember? Yeah, right. we calm it like ice. You put ice to numb the, the 
the wound. There's no wound, Bucket. No <coughs> wound. Everything is fine. The gentleman is on board his ship. He, he, he can hear the snoring. He's sleeping just fine. We're, we're good. Everything is perfectly normal and safe. With a light, I think you can see if anything approaches your house now, Vios. Yeah, they can do... Uh, uh, That's sh- good. They can do shadow puppets, too. Oh. Oh. That's an idea for pain. <laughs> no army approaches. No, 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 no army. No army. Oh, that's right. Raising. They're just a group, a loosely aligned group that's not an army and they're only here to wear clothing for some reason. Exactly. That they are not moving. They are stationary. They are inanimate. They are just to display the products of the gentleman Taylor on board the ship. And they definitely don't go. Ooh, ooh. No, no, no. Pocket, pocket, pocket. Calming fears. Not, not, not. You know, calming fears. That's why I said they didn't go. Because of their victims. My life. Ah. No, none of those noises have been heard. All I hear is a parrot. Yeah, it might be a dead parrot. <laughs> uh. The parrot is perfectly alive, look. Well, right now it is. Now it is. Elias has been pretty good with the, the, the gun lately, so. Elias is a quick, a quick shot, and he's a true shot. Well, that's good. Uh, Elias, uh, are you all right? Is everything, are, are we on a good, um, stable ground here? We, we are an understanding that there is no danger? Currently no danger. Perfect. That, that that's a good start. Um, Bogget, Bogget, the Tansy. Uh, let, let's try to keep it uh, that way, right? Mm-hmm. Now, in, encouragement. Let's let's uh, let's uh, you know. How how can I control the army? Let, no no no. There we go again. No army. There's no uh, army. Uh, Tan- Tan- Tansy, do you have any cookies? Uh, maybe may- maybe we can put a plate of cookies and milk outside of. Uh, Elias's door, and he'll come out and uh, have some oh. cookies and milk with us. Yeah, I do have some cookies. Let me grab them. Is that better? Yes, very good. Good, good, for, good steps in the right direction. I think it's better than two steps forward to that ship. I, well, I, I was just down there. I, I came back just fine, didn't I? Uh, yes. You were close enough to hear him snore, so yes. Right, right. Everything is good. Everything is fine. Everything is normal. There's no threats. We're, we're perfectly fine. Oh, that's the thing. Um, yeah. Well, we've got the light now. Shadows lurking. However, however, precedent shows us that that ship has been here for several nights and we've had no issues, right? I suppose. Hey, Lost, do you want to come out for a cookie or a coconut cream pie? Oh, uh, coconut cream pie. I didn't know you had coconut cream pie. That sounds delightful. Okay, well, it's real good. How about some brandy? Would you like some brandy, uh, Elias? Anybody else? 
that you could come out here and we could share a glass, you know. No, I suppose not. I've got some wine and vodka that'll help me stay awake. Uh, well, good idea. What about a cup of coffee? Oh. Uh, I got some roasted coffee beans. Uh, surely we can put it in a cup somewhere. I could just eat the coffee. I'm beans. not sure how. Uh, hmm. uh, is there some it's by themselves? Is there some place to mix uh, the 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 coffee with the, the the fluid? That's what I'm not sure of. Hmm. Well, I do agree. You could just eat the coffee beans. Bogot is not incorrect there. Mm, that's true. Do you want some coffee beans, though, Oz? <laughs> I think Elias is waiting for the night time to come. Mm-hmm. Well. Well, I... did anybody else want a cookie or a cream pie? Oh, no, no. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank All you. Right, I'm going to get Do some just... coffee beans. Well, this went nice. <laughs> it, 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 it has gone fine so far. There's been no gunshots, right? Right? It couldn't have gone better. Now Elias knows everything. I mean, it could have gone a little better, but uh, it didn't go horribly bad. We haven't gone 24 hours since uh, uh, the incident, I guess. The what incident? The army. Oh, uh, where'd he go? Oh, there. Yeah. Uh, is it okay if I bring these coffee beans in? It's okay. So, so have we have we made it to step one, acceptance? I suppose uh, that is probably Brad. Uh, yeah, will help sure you stay away. The other style, though. <laughs> I Thank like you. the door, by the way. You're welcome. I repainted it. Gold didn't look good. It looked good, but I think this suits you better. Stands out. Mm hmm. All right. Well. I am going to uh, retire for the evening. I'm very confident that nothing, nothing notorious, nothing mm. nefarious, nothing dangerous is going to happen here. How wonderful. Mm -hmm. It's going to be so wonderful. Yes, best sleep of my life, knowing how safe the port is. So there's nothing to worry about. Right, Elias? I'll be awake. But you should probably get some sleep, sir. You know, you don't want to tire yourself out. Yes, uh, you probably get some sleep. Uh, we do have a private showing tomorrow at nine thirty. Oh, do you? That's great. Yes, uh, as as probably a hard rock band named Black Rose or something. Oh, oh, oh that sounds fun. Do you think oh. they're going to perform too? Mm, I don't know. Um. <laughs> Black Rose, you say? Yeah, don't know nothing about him, but yeah, they, he said uh, the company Black Rose, probably a pretty sizable group. Fair. Oh, wait. No, no, it, it's no nothing to worry about. Uh, I think right, that's right. one of their songs. Well, technically, 
Yes, uh, but perhaps uh, Bogota, Bogota, one of you could sing that to them, or you know, put it, uh, say it to them in prose. You know. I'm not sure what that is. It's a song, I guess. I think the sun's going down now, Elias. It won't be long till we can see in the dark. Make mm -hmm. sure the lighting is set right. Right with that note, I I'm going to go retire and I will uh, see you all tomorrow and uh, I'll, I'll try to, to be around, you know. Sounds good. Okay, have a peaceful sleep. Good luck, sleep. everyone. Good yes, luck. Uh, do you know that uh, my building is the closest to the ship uh, and I, I am very confident that I'm very safe uh, sleeping there. Oh, should we put a spotlight into next to uh, Owen's house so that it's shining on the ship? No. Oh, that's a good idea. No, that, that's com completely not necessary. What is he all the way down, man? <laughs> I, I think you're overreacting just a little bit. I, it, it's perfectly fine. It was perfectly fine when we smelt the dead fish. <laughs> mm -hmm. Everything's perfectly fine until it isn't. All right, well, I'm going to bed. Good night. Good night. Good night. Sleep with one eye open. Don't let the Not bed bugs no fall. No need. No need at all. <laughs> All right, we got a new spotlight at the end there. Aimed just onto the ship. That's a good idea. Okay, I think I'm going to retire. Yeah, I should too. Good night. Have a good night. Watch out for the clockwork. All right, good night, Tansy. See you tomorrow. Good night, Elias. All right, Pocket, it's time. <laughs> I put the new barley scene right here, Pocket. Well, let me have uh, till the ground. It was beans, but I removed the beans and put the barley there. I'm not sure what it looks like. I don't remember beans being here, but... Okay, chat, that's the end of my stream tonight. We'll, we'll be back tomorrow. And uh, we're, we got the museum open tomorrow, so hopefully we'll have some tours. We do have a scheduled private viewing tomorrow evening, so the museum will be closed on Saturday. Uh, but we'll be back at it on Sunday.
Good night. Bye. So, thanks for joining me. Have a great night. Bye, y'all. <laughs>